I'm gonna talk to y'all about how I've been able to keep my beautiful Brazilian curls fresh, all right? Now, curly hair has always been a pain in the booty for me because I can't stand dealing with the maintenance that it requires. But I've learned through using different products and trying different techniques what works for me. And I'm gonna share that with you guys in this video. So if you wanna see how I've been able to work with this hair for the last month, and yes guys, I've had this hair for a full month, which is a little longer than my sponsor probably wanted me to have it for, but whatever. I wanted to be honest with you guys and share with you the true nature of how this hair holds up. So, here we go. First things first, I'm wetting the lace and I'm going to go in with my Shimmer Light Shampoo to kind of bring back that nice toned look that I got after I first bleached the knots. I always use this on the lace just to make sure that it's always fresh and the color is on point. And I'm just going to rinse that away to move on to the rest of the hair. And I'm using this Ion Conditioning Keratin Mask. I've had this for a while now. I honestly just use it for my wigs. So I'm gonna distribute the mask throughout the wig from root to tip with my fingers, and then I'm gonna follow up with a wide tooth comb. I start with my fingers first, just so I can have less snags and detangle problems, but you can just go straight into it with your wide tooth comb. Then I follow up with my Denman brush and make sure that I start from root to tip as well because that's gonna help me get the curl pattern back. I'm scrunching up the hair from the bottom up just to kind of retain the curl patterns. Taking my S Factor Dream Drop Shine Serum, I'm going to take a lot of pumps of it and put it all over the hair from root to tip as well. This just gives it some shine and a really freaking nice smell. Oh my gosh, this stuff smells amazing. I actually just saw this product in my cabinet and thought to try it since it said it's for curls, but this Affigy style rapid mousse is great because whenever I use it, it really does hold the style in perfectly without making the hair feel bad. Like, you know what I'm saying? And I'm just taking my Demon brush one more time and Ooh, I'm going to town right now on that hair, but like I said take y'all's time when you do this like you know put it on a wig stand if it helps And the final step is to flip the wig over and put it on your wig stand The reason I do that is so when it air dries It's gonna make sure the roots are a little bit lifted giving it some more body than if it were flipped the right side so that's what I do, and I leave a little towel to kind of catch the water to absorb the end. And this is the result, guys. It was such an easy process for me. Um, there's a lot of other techniques out there. I think you should just keep trying what you think works for you, but I think the shine looks great, the feeling of it looks great, and my curls last for freaking ever. If I didn't work out as much as I did, I don't think <laughs> I don't think I would need to do this very often, honestly. So thank you guys for watching this tutorial.